Go eat and eat. <laughs> you would just introduce yourself? Absolutely. My name is Anthony Murata. I live at 327 North Lakeside Drive, and I have the honor of being the president of Pear Cove. Uh, good evening, Madam Mayor, esteemed commissioner, city manager, city attorney, city clerk. Uh, I'll give you a little background on Parrot Cove for those of you who may not be familiar with it. Uh, it consists of approximately 600 homes. Uh, we're bordered by Lucerne on the south, Federal on the west, and 13th on the north. And we have the Intercoastal on the east. Uh, not nearly as impressive as uh, Representative Hayers, but I'll take it. That's fine. <laughs> uh, formed in 2001, uh, the goal of creating and fostering a friendly and social place to live, uh, as well as to help beautify uh, the neighborhood. Our annual cost is ten dollars per person or twenty for the household, so it's very, very affordable. Uh, with that, it includes uh, receiving email notifications about the neighborhood activities and what's going on, helping to be part of the ongoing efforts for community improvement, and most importantly, no cost admission to several of the association's parties uh, that we have throughout the year. In addition to that, Paracove is a member of the Neighborhood Association President's Council of the NAPC. Uh, so once a month we get to meet with our other board presidents, exchange ideas, uh, and bring our voices together to be heard. So we're uh, very happy for that opportunity. To reach all of the residents in Paracove, we also publish a newsletter five to six times per year. It goes to all 600 homes that are in there. Uh, reminds people to renew their memberships about upcoming parties, events, and any you noteworthy know, items. We've had a focus on fostering and providing for enjoyable social gatherings uh, and a sense of community. We had about 120 people attend our holiday party at Bradley's this December, which included food provided by Bradley's, which was excellent, as well as two drink tickets. So if you do the math at $10 a person, two drink tickets alone paid up for that. So it really is an excellent value. Uh, our block party was in April. It was held on Gulf View. Uh, it was a great success with over 100 people attending. A lot of the Residents brought in wonderful dishes, so we actually had quite a lot of food uh, there left over, as well as we had a live band playing for us, too. Our next party is planned for early August. It's going to be at a, a residence home, which is yet to be chosen. Perico will provide uh, a certain budget to that resident, and they can spend that how they see fit, whether it be food, entertainment, drinks, what have you. And once again, we'll have our, our residents be bringing in food items. Just a, a couple of brief accomplishments here. Uh, that we've had. Uh, Perico did win the Wacky Water Station competition uh, for the Long Beaches Marathon where we had our pair of dancing around. Uh, yeah. We brought in $250 prize for that and the accolades on that one go to Terry Ralston, the former president, who put all that together and was out there sweating in the Paracos. So we were providing refreshments to the runners who surprisingly many of whom said thanks. So that was that was quite nice as well. We provided approximately 29 volunteer shifts to staff the beer tents for the street painting festival, which also allowed us to earn a couple hundred dollars to go into our party fund too. A few things we're working on right now. At our last board meeting, we approved a change in our logo to replace the black background one, which we're a little low tech here today, so this is what we're going with. It's black. We are now switching it to this lovely yellow. So yellow is the winner. So we'll be replacing all of our banners, uh, logos, corporate stock, everything that we have will be switched out uh, with that. We, we held off on that because we do have a lot of the banners that are falling down, missing, just vanished, gone. So now we're going to go through and get everything looking a little, a little neater and uh, more tidy. We're in the infancy stage of planning an initiative on working to keep our neighborhood beautiful. Although fairly rare, we, like other communities, are subject to some graffiti. We're working on a plan to get more residents involved in notifying us when it takes place and volunteers to help with the removal. We have purchased some supplies to assist with us where we can. Here is an example of a uh, lovely individual's handiwork. Not, not the best speller, but close enough. <laughs> and this is afterwards. So it's gone. No cost to the city. We took care of that. We're going to do the one that we spent on our We will be participating in the raft race again this year. Uh, we're working on relaunching our Facebook page. We have a very nice volunteer in our community who's going to be uploading pictures and 
uh, taking care of updates and notices for us as well. And the big part is the planning has begun for our premier event, which is the much anticipated home and garden tour. So we're working on locking up some of the, the homes now that we'll have on that. We had a lot of people contacting us through our website asking if that was going to be happening this year. And unfortunately, we had to let them know it didn't. So we will have that at uh, the beginning of March for 2015. We sell approximately 600 tickets. That is our main fundraising event uh, because we're fortunate to have many historic homes, beautiful gardens, great architecture from our residents and people here to do that. And that is it from me. I'll entertain any questions if you like. Sure. Yes. Andrew, thank you again for uh, putting all the energy into it, and uh, yeah, Parrot Grove right. is a very active neighborhood association. Thank you. Um, there's a lot of cottages in your neighborhood. Yeah, uh, there's 600. There's at least maybe 20 percent or so. It's, it's a high number. So you all been working with the group uh, in that effort too. Well, the Cottages group has pretty much taken the lead on that, uh, and they're doing a wonderful job, an excellent job, highlighting not just the ones in our neighborhood, but around the community. Uh, we did coordinate a little bit with them on the tours. There's going to be in January, ours will be in March, that way we wouldn't have any overlap uh, or conflicts. And we were looking at some initiatives for after they've primed up the people, then we'll get them in afterwards for hours. <coughs> I, I wanted to thank you for uh, taking the lead on graffiti. Um, there was some graffiti this week um, on the band shell, and um, I was out there today taking a lot of that off, and, and the city will finish and come by with the paint. But um, I want to thank you for taking the lead, because a lot of times uh, it only takes a minute. And you know I carry, I think, a goo beak off in my car and a little bit of white paint. Um, so I encourage more people and, and the neighborhoods to step up. and. And, you know, the quickest response time fixes everything because a lot of those tags become two, three, four because they're there for a long period of time. Um, and so I want to thank you uh, for stepping up to the plate. And then also, um, you know, the fundraiser in me uh, wants one of those banners. So I would love for you to uh, maybe work with the cottages and donate the old banners to the cottage for a fundraiser. Okay. Uh, because I know the cottages are looking to raise some funds and whatever banners you, you have, you know, I'd love to bid on one of those banners. We can do that to take home. We'll, uh, we'll one up that and I'll autograph them for you. Too. <laughs> 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 or, absolutely, or, or everybody in the neighborhood sign them. And, there you go. Have some of that graffiti, we'll leave them out. Absolutely. <laughs> yeah. we'll Thank you. First. Thank you so Thank much. We appreciate it. I'm glad the tour's coming back, right. too. I'm looking forward to that myself. Thanks very much for your time. Thank you. Thank you. Okay.